My name is Noel Kelly and I am the Director of Visual Artists Ireland um, and I'm here in our new office in Belfast which uh, we were founded in 1980 and since 1980 we have been an All-Ireland body um, but only in the last few months have we been able to realise uh, one of the dreams that we've had for a very, very long time and that is to have a very physical presence uh, in Northern Ireland. We decided that this was the most opportune moment uh, to come because everyone in the sector is uh, going, knows about the hard times. We don't have to tell people. Um, so we decided that this is a really good time for us to actually come, take an opportunity of having uh, a recessionary environment which makes it actually affordable for us to find a space in Belfast and also to start to further develop the services that we've been delivering. So Visual Artists Ireland has done amazing work here in Northern Ireland over a number of years, but with the past couple of years they've really stepped up to the mark. They've given us a new Northern Ireland manager which has made a, na a massive difference. And the actual range of services that's been launched here today is also going to be a benefit for the artists themselves. Um, we in the Arts Council feel that the, the investment in BAI and the investment in creating a new space for them is very good value for money. Uh, they will now have a service that they'll be able to provide, a confidential and a one-to-one -one service for artists who need their help and support. So we have just launched four new products, um, or four new services. Three of them are specifically for artists in Northern Ireland. Uh, the first is a very exciting uh, new adventure for us uh, with one of our corporate sponsors, Suki T, and also in collaboration with Arts and Business in Northern Ireland. Uh, both of them have been very strong supporters uh, of VAI over the, especially in the last year when Suki T came on board and was the primary sponsor for Belfast Open Studios. So this year, uh, the collaboration will take the form of a new art prize. So all artists uh, based in Northern Ireland will be eligible to enter and VAI members uh, from the rest um, of the country will also be eligible. Uh, the top prize is £2,000. Uh, the runners up will be four runners up who will each receive £250 and the prize will be accompanied by an exhibition, the launch exhibition, uh, which we are delighted to say will be actually instalment so we will be bringing the visual arts into uh, maybe a centre of power that might not really appreciate the depth and vibrancy um, on an everyday basis that we see. Uh, one of the things we have worked with for over many years is to try and get artist insurance available um, for free uh, for BAI members. So we have negotiated a, a special deal where public and um, product liability insurance will be available to all VAI members as part of their membership fee. And we're delighted that this has been sponsored um, by another one of our corporate partners, Standard Utilities, um, who over the last year we've developed and kind of danced around each other trying to figure out a significant project. So we felt this is the one that's going to affect the lives of artists sort of in the most meaningful way. Um, the third one, um, is the launch of a new news service dedicated to artists and the art organisations of Northern Ireland. Um, it is taking uh, input from our normal news service, which the e-bulletins, everyone is, is uh, aware, one of the primary sources of information for jobs and ops and exhibitions and events. This one would be purely dedicated to opportunities, exhibitions and events for artists in Northern Ireland and will also be taking input from across the United Kingdom and um, the South so that it's a very comprehensive view um, of opportunities for every artist. And the fourth um, we have just launched is called the Marketplace and the Marketplace is an area, it's an online uh, site, uh, visualartistsireland.com and in the marketplace it gives artists an opportunity to uh, trade, to put things to sell, up for sale or actually to sort of do a call out that they're looking. So it's, a, it's an enhancement of the service that we offer through our normal website but it's actually one that it's sort of like a more personal thing. So it's like gum tree for artists. Um, so this is kind of a, an exciting new departure for us as well. The Arts Council is delighted to have made this investment in Visual Artists Ireland in the new office space and we wish the team every success for the future.